Hey everyone, this is Rocky. Hey, I want to do a review on a knife today that I bought. Um, mainly because I haven't seen a um, review on it at all on YouTube. I've seen similar knives and the one bigger than this, but not on this one. So, <clears throat> let's uh, talk about this knife. This is the old timer 123ot okay this is not american made this is made by taylor in china but that's not to say this isn't a very nice knife it's got all brass bolsters um, brass liners a heavy spring it's got a high carbon stainless steel blade um, the blade is 3.1 inches, the handle is 4 inches, so this is uh, 7.1 inches overall. It was razor sharp out of the box, it would, it, it'll shave, and I have not um, sharpened it, but I don't know if you can see that, but... It, it's shaving sharp. Um, it is a slip joint knife. <clears throat> uh, has no lock on it, but it's got a half stop, right? And it's got a nice chatter to it. Got a nice uh, lock up, and then a nice, uh, it, it's really nice. It comes with a piece of leather for a lanyard. It's got a lanyard hole in it. But what this uh, knife is modeled after is the, uh, I believe the 125 OT Mustang, okay? And it is quite a bit larger. It's like five inch handle, four inch blade. It's very, very comparable to the uh, size of a buck 110, okay? This knife right here is probably, uh, it's about the smallest that I will carry for a pocket knife. As you can see, it fits my hand really well. Um, uh, it's a really nice knife, you guys. Even though it's made in China, uh, Charade Old, time, old, old Timer has minimum requirements uh, for quality. And, uh, I mean, you can see it in this knife. It's, it's very nice, very very nice and um, I've just got into uh, carrying these old pocket knives uh, more lately I've quit carrying the uh, pocket clip knives because I'm left-handed uh, when it hooks my seat belt I either rip clip off bend the clip or leave the knife on my seat belt when I get out so I've started carrying knives in a pancake holster and uh, on my left hip and that's what I carry this in um, like I said very nice knife really really good quality for a $22 knife so I don't think you can beat it um, but anyway I hadn't seen any reviews on this knife at all and so I just wanted to give my my outlook on it one more time it's the Schrade old timer 123 OT and you guys you can't go wrong with this knife this is a really really nice knife if you're uh, looking for a nice EDC pocket knife that is super easy to sharpen because uh, you guys I'm I'm just gonna talk about steels for a minute the s30b and the and the stuff like that they're a nice steel a nice knife blade steel but they're hard to sharpen, and believe it or not, they do get dull. When these uh, stainless steel high carbon uh, blades get dull, they're easy to sharpen. And if you carry around, like I do, I carry a uh, a coin sharpener, like like this, a coin knife sharpener which is from Sharpen's Best. Um, 
it's really uh, super easy to sharpen up one of these blades and get it right back to razor sharp. So um, there you have it. Um, that's what I'm carrying lately and uh, that's what I'm going to carry for a while and see how I like it. But uh, I don't think I'll be disappointed in it at all. So have a good day. I hope you had a great New Year and a great Christmas. Um, hit me up in the comments. Tell me what you think of this knife. All right. We'll talk to you later.